Okay, we're back. Starting where we left off. Now we're in a perfect position to head back upstairs. Something's not right. The Emperor! He's dead! What's going on? Why is he standing up? Hey! There's a passageway behind the altar! When that get? Okay, the Emperor is dead. You're the one who betrayed the Emperor! I'm afraid so. Now that we control the Mana Fortress, we control the whole world. Who's we? Thanatos. Aha, the children are back. It has been a while. What have you done with Dyluk? Is he safe? Of course. I wouldn't want anything to happen to my new body, after all. What? He does not owe you an explanation. Sir, please head to the fortress. I will get revenge for Sheiks and Gestar right here and now. Goodbye, pests. Okay, boss battle time. Um, let's just go through the standard rotation of figuring out weaknesses, and then we'll perhaps hit it with a couple of spells. Okay, it didn't tell me what a weakness was, but I'm going to assume that it's weakness to the usual kind of darkness weak power. Although this boss isn't proving to have a lot of um, having a lot of defense, so it takes hits pretty hard. Ah, damn it. Good thing I picked this up. A 3400 HP, taking quite a few, uh, quite a few hit points of damage every time I hit it. Hit her. Kind of this Naga look. A lot of the other bosses in this game, you fight end up fighting twice, or you fight two versions that are very similar to each other. But we're pretty deep into the game, and this is the first time we're encountering this Naga monster. Nothing to dispel. Why did you do that? <laughs> Hit him twice. Oh, I can actually do some damage. That's not it. Of course, uh, might as well do acid storm. Fight would be over if I didn't miss so damn often. Two fifty one, awesome. and it's dead. Betrayed the Emperor, and then we killed you. Not that the Emperor was a good fella or anything like that, so I'm not feeling too bad about his betrayal. Ooh, a whip orb. Thanatos. Why?
Geshtar, you survive? You could say he is and isn't Geshtar. I've used ancient magic to create a living machine. Now my faithful servants can serve me in death as well. You're the lowest of the low. <laughs> Alright, so this is the third time essentially that we have fought Geshtar in this sort of mech rider form. But it's um it's Geshtar is dead though, so it's just some sort of a a zombie or something. Come on. Give me the damn sprite. Miss for no damn reason. Repel the magic, huh? Oh, that's right. Had wall. On. Okay, gonna have to just the old fashioned way. Now we have a wide play field, unlike at the top of the Emperor's Castle. So we have plenty of plenty of. Uh, oh shit. Plenty of space to just sort of stay out of his way. I don't know what the hell he's trying to do, but it's not working for him. Do I have like a dispel ability? Something to dispel magic? Wall. No. Are you gonna analyze Sprite? <laughs> Once his magic fades, because it will eventually, I believe. Then I'm gonna hit him with that acid spell. All right, girl, time to cure everybody. Sprite didn't take any healing until he woke up. This is not an exciting fight. Oh. Unconscious. Take more than that. All right, Sprite, you got to change your weapon. You're not doing us any good with that. Two misses and a hit for barely any damage. Critical hit, but I don't know how much it's for. Because the old damage indicators tend to overwrite each other. <laughs> Let me just check my volume. I think I might be off. Um, Alright, that might be a little better. Had to turn the volume down. Actually, you know what? Uh, probably a better way to do this is to uh, let's just make sure that the yeah okay voiceover is up high. All right, so I can step back from the microphone a little bit, so it's probably too close. Oh, okay. Cure him, because I don't have any cups of wishes. Ooh, level five. Would have been at level five a long time ago, had I tried.
Die, damn it. 185. Actually landing a few hits now. Alright, just die. We're getting bored here. Your magic down yet? Your wall down yet? Nope, it's not. Get over here and die. Oh, come on. I mean, it's the same fight, but they attempt to ramp up the difficulty just by giving him more health and probably a higher attack power. But if the, there isn't really a lot of strategy to the fight, then it's it just becomes a grind. Just trying to hope that he runs out of HP before you run out of either curative abilities or um, whatever. Okay, she's not doing a lot of damage with that axe, so I'm going to get that off of her. Wrong character. Okay, I think she might have done that. Oh, it's weird, because the axe shows a higher damage potential than the sword does. So I wonder. Did I miss an orb somewhere? Damn it. Die. And finally. Way to go. Another spear orb, but I haven't gotten a sword orb yet. They activated the mana fortress. The whole place is gonna sink. It got inside somehow. Okay, the place sank again, but now the Mana Fortress is in the sky. Let's see if we can find it. There it is. Ugh, we can't get through the shield. Let's fall back. All right, that's it. Match Fortress has risen, but we can't get on board. So, well, we're screwed, aren't we?